I I knew I I I think that Michael is a part of the FBI. Because you see there there was a time where I had switched to Michael, like I, I was just playing around by myself without having uh like doing any of the story. And he was in a undercover car. And I didn't notice that until I Lester, what hey, you Lester. want? Mike, hey, uh, I'm transferring your cut of the jewel store take to your account. Madrazo's already got the house money, so you can rest easy there. Ah, thank God for that. And there goes our money. Um, what happened? Um, there was a car. It actually looked almost exactly like this car. Nah, that's not. But it was. It's. It's pretty much that car. And I tried to, I tried to uh, change the radio station because I was like, why is the radio off? So I tried to turn on the radio, which I need to turn this off right now anyway. Um, I tried to turn, change the radio station. I kept noticing I hear the dispatch. When you're in the cop cars, you can't change the radio station because all you have is the dispatch radio. So I kept hearing that and I was like, why is, why do I hear this? And uh, I tried to press my horn to beep at some guy and then the siren came on which was hidden in the back so that means it was an undercover car but not only that but Michael had changed his clothes into a suit and he was wearing black sunglasses so I don't I don't I don't know I, I don't understand new statement thanks yeah thanks 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 you can you can close that you can no all right, thanks. But yeah, I I I thought that he was an uh, just an undercover cop, but we'll see. I guess I don't know. I think that he's a uh, think that he may be a, a undercover FBI agent. He may be doing all this, and we just we we're just gonna find out now. We have to act like we don't know anything. I park here. I go. Gotta hop up these stairs. <sighs> How do I get in? I go around back. Probably go around back. This reminds me of I don't know if anybody's played Mafia 2, but the ending. Um the ending of Mafia 2. This is like the same area. No. Holy shit. Whatever, dude. Uh, I'm not gonna get down. Oh. Well, that'll work. Let's see. Back here. Ah, uh, there you are. Davy. How you doing? About as good as can be expected. But the news is not good. I don't know what you're talking about. I know you did that fucking jewelry job. Davy, seriously, you're imagining things. Fuck you. All right. I did it. Arrest me. You know what? You'll be saving my life. Because you called it, motherfucker. What? You called it. Trevor. A couple days ago. But we haven't really talked about anything either. But if, no, when, he starts asking questions about why you're not feeding worms south of the Canadian border. Oh, we got problems. Yeah, no shit. We're in it. Together. So, if your problems are my problems, then I guess that means that my problems are sort of your problems. <laughs> uh-uh. Nope. What if I lose my job? Someone comes into my office, starts reading my files. They'll see the things I did. I know a lot of stuff. I can cop a plea, get five years, but you... Fuck you, you ungrateful prick. I made your career. Well... Then we better go about saving it together, because... You and I both know we can't let it go to shit now. What do you need? This guy. Ferdinand Karamov. The agency claims he's dead. We at the bureau think they're full of crap. We think he's being debriefed someplace. So he is so, FBI. Apparently, 
or he's working with the FBI, which is essentially the same thing, except for he's just not getting paid. Coroner's office locked down. We need you to verify the body. So how the hell am I gonna get in here? Well, you've played dead before, haven't you? All right, nice job walking straight into that, Michael. Michael, you good, Michael? All right, see you later, Michael. Michael, you good? No, okay. All right, I was just gonna ask you. You all right? No, okay. I was just checking. Oh, what's that? You're you're not okay? No, no. Oh, you're inside of a bag. Oh, okay. I see. I see. But but are you are you okay? No. No. No, you're not. Oh, oh okay. The fat deposits on his hips and abdomen suggest a fondness for bleeder burgers. Probably about to find one in his gut. Still in his wrapper. Am I allowed to look around? What's going on? Don't worry, it's just gas. No, no. What? Trying to kill me? Trying to kill me? You die. See you later. I don't think he's dead. Let's make sure he's dead. You get some clothes first. Where's my clothes? Hands in the air. No. Who are you? How do you not see Michael's extremely bright bald head next to this extremely bright light? Now he he's 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 Max Payne. I give up. He's wearing the same outfit as Max Payne. See you later. Search the morgue for the body. What body exactly are we looking for? Is this a nightmare? Is this? That don't look right. But what am I looking for? Guess you can't judge a corpse by its toe tag. I found the toe tag. Ferdinand Karamov. It's on some big black lady. Definitely not your guy. Okay. The agency have the lower floors on lockdown to prevent a leak. I got a guy who can cut the power to give you some help. But you'll have to get upstairs if you're gonna get out. So this was planned. I didn't know this was all planned. Oh god. <clears throat> you sit down. No. No. Uh-uh. No. Wait, wait. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yeah, I forgot he turns into Mike Max Payne. Let's run in here. Oh god, and he even dies like Max Payne. First you were in Dead Space, and now you're in GTA. Might as well just be playing all all Rockstar games all the time, 100% of the time. No, you sit down. That's what you do. You go nowhere. Stick your head out. Oh, you stick your arm out? You kidding me? I don't know what's going on here, but I want the fuck out. No, Michael, you idiot. No. I'm gonna die because Michael decided he wanted to run against that wall. Ah, gotcha. Come on, come out, come out, come out. Stealth takedowns. You stay down. I said stay down. I think this other guy is still alive over here. Oh, you kidding me? Boom! Alright, let's get going. I should have stayed on the slab. We're inside of a hospital. How do I not? Oh my god! <laughs> it's just unlimited of them. How am I like? What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to hide and wait? Cause they know I'm here. You freeze! Hands up! How does this guy know where I am? Look at him, he's looking right at me through the wall. You kidding me? Yeah, you better back off. Trust me! I'm not interested in the troll! Ah, oh, the shots missed. Thank you, the headshot. That's what I wanted. 
come out. It's all a big misunderstanding. How am I not shooting your kneecap right now? I don't understand what's going on here. Oh my god. This freaking guy every time. Boom. Boom. Yeah, so those guys are down. But it's his way out. See you later. Let's get going. You die. You will die. Because uh, I'm close to the edge. I'm trying not to lose my head, which you just did. <sighs> no, seriously. Just let me go. Didn't I tell you to stop saying you die? I warned you. Boom. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. He's down. Hey, I already died once today. You're not dead, huh? Did I really kill him by stepping on his hand? He's like, ah, oh, my fingers. You fractured my fingers and now they now I'm bleeding internally. You're a threat to national security. This is fucked. We're locked down. Gotta take the stairs. Oh my god. <laughs> mm. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. Michael, your weapons will be in the black trash bag in the evidence room from the top floor. Well, I'm trying to get to the top floor, and I was just in the elevator, but it absolutely did nothing. You kidding me? Is it going to let me go? No. How do I get in the elevator and use this? There's not even a button in here. <sighs> do we have to walk up there? Indeed we do. Uh, let's see, is there anything down here? No. Let's get up these stairs. Since this game thinks it's funny or something. You shut up and sit down. No one gets in or out. But I'll die. What? That's what I thought. Still got more floors to go out. Somebody's gonna come out. I know he is. Yep. Did I say you could get up? You sit down, son. Out of my way. Sir. I didn't say you could get up. Where are these guys at? I can't escape through the window. I need my guns. Alright, Max, get your guns and let's go. No. I am the greatest good you will ever have. No. That's what you get. Think you're cool talking trash? Oh, you are the weakest thing I've ever seen, Michael. What's wrong with you? You have a gun in your hand and you can't even... can't even... Uh, oh, come on. I want him to have some great leap. Like a leap of faith. Just through the window or slide out of it. Just, just not even care. You see nothing. Uh, let's go. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, you don't see anything. Oh, isn't that less? 
Lice? Isn't that nice? I don't want lice. It's not what I'm asking for. Oh. I see. I don't know, you're in my way. Yeah, you did hit me. Son. Or... Daughter. Whatever. Get off my back, son. Whoever you are. I'm no driver. Hi, Michael. I just hit that. I will not stop this vehicle. I will actually do so. No such thing. No such thing. No, sir. No, sir. Keep going. What is that? What does that say? I can't read that. I think that's that stupid, uh, the drink that Trevor is always drinking. That's like fresh something. F-R-E-S something. Alright, awesome. Driven more than 500 miles. Mm. Come on. Oh my god, no, we can't go this way. Did they really spot me? This is the one thing I hate about this game. I consider it an actual problem. Like, in the older games, I don't, I don't want it to be easy for you to escape them. But it seems as though a lot of your missions are dependent on escaping them. And that'll, like, grant you, like, a better time and such. But they kind of, like, they just come out of nowhere. And they just seem to keep going. Oh, great. No, oh, get out of my way. Yeah, like I was saying, they they just seem to be... Look at that, the person who spotted me wasn't even that car that drove by. It was somebody who was on the street, across the street. Somehow seeing me just, you know, parked there. Spotted me out. And while I like, you know, good, I, good AI, this isn't necessarily good AI. They spawn where you're, where you're going. Like, instead of you cutting them off by going a different direction, they just, look at that. They spawn, they spawn in your direction, and then they, cha they change their direction to come directly towards you, which means they're going to spawn to you. Like, this guy in front of me is most likely going to turn around, even though there was clearly nobody there until now. And it takes so long to get rid of them, it makes no sense. Even if you have, like, one star... Three stars is understandable. One star is not. Franklin. Hey, Mike. F. Hey, we need to talk. Quick. Meet me at those oil derricks just outside town of rural heights. And make sure you're not tailed. Man, that don't sound too good, homie. Look, I'm on my way. Oh, no. Not Franklin. How many people are you gonna call, Mike? Dave. Cool. The hell was that? You know how many spooks I just ran into? I'm sorry. They're not nice people if that's a consolation. What's going on? There's a big target out there. Something in the shadows. The data algorithms are reading off the charts. Whoever finds it, the bureau or the agency, is gonna get a big bump in funding. Like I care about your funding. I'm out, Dave. You're not. I need you to meet my boss. We'll be downtown in the plaza between the FIB and the IAA buildings. The IAA I call the shots buildings. here, Dave. You fucking kidding me after the spat I just had with those agency men? Relax. They won't be looking there. They never expect an inside job. And that's what they always say. And then it turns into Scooby Doo. And if it wasn't for those meddling kids and their dog, they wouldn't have been found out, right? Yeah? Yeah? That's what we're gonna go for? That's what we're going for. That's how this game's gonna end. It's just gonna end. It's gonna end like that. I call it. I call it now. Right now. Nobody else can take that, even though a bunch of people have already beaten the game. Actually, not a bunch, like almost everybody. Hey, Franklin, what's going on? Yeah, what's up, Franklin? Man, I ain't exactly got nowhere to go. Well, then take a trip. 
A long trip. What the fuck is going on? Things, all right? Look, you remember I told you I know people, feds, who looked after me when I retired? You did? Yeah, I did. I mean, I think I did. I don't know. Shit, Jesus Christ, Franklin. I got so many stories, I can't even keep them straight. I'm full of shit. Yeah, but your full of shit got me a lot of paper. One score with you, I made more money than I ever did hustling. Oh, yeah, I mean, I'm a great thief, but you know, it's the other shit that I ain't got figured out. So what's the deal, man? What's the deal with the Bureau, man? This clown. I mean, he's an okay guy. Fucking cocksucker. We did a deal a long time ago. Didn't go quite the way it was supposed to go. Wrong guy got killed. So I had to go into kind of a, an informal witness protection program. He helped me. I didn't reveal secrets of his. And everything was cool. Problem started when recently I became unretired. I mean, he shows up, starts calling in favors, telling me to do shit. I mean, look, Franklin, I'm working for the fucking feds. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, fuck, man. Yeah, and that ain't even the worst part. <sighs> Did I ever tell you about Trevor? Hmm? Uh, man, I, I think so. Shit. Well, if you only think so, then I wasn't being completely honest. He's, I don't hell walking on Earth. That's what he is. <laughs> well, let's bury this motherfucker. Can't oh, do yeah, that. Good luck with that. Shit. I mean, Trevor and I got history. Complicated fucking history. Look, I've done a lot of things that I ain't proud of. Okay, I never claimed to be an angel. But you meet Trevor Franklin, you'll swear I am an angel. So what's the mood in, man? I don't know. Fuck. I'm just gonna, you know, try to play both sides. You know, until I can find a way out of this shit. All right, man, look, man, you help me. The way I see it, man, the least I can do is help you. Too bad he didn't That's because he ruined you. Well, not really. I ain't trying to hear all that shit, man. If you the were only working with Simeon. Court, them motherfuckers just hustlers anyway. And I ain't finna let no motherfucking cat think he's so motherfucking crazy run me up a tree. Fuck that. Hey, you're a good kid, Franklin. This means a lot to me. Like I told you, I'm a terrific thief. I'll find something for you. Big. Now come on. You better take off. Alright, man. I'm with you. I'm with you. They boost off. Look how fast he went. Can't even see him anymore. He's gone. Mission passed. Dead man. Well, oh my god. We got every. Oh no, we didn't. We didn't get that accuracy checkpoint. Unmarked. Which I guess means I wasn't caught, but that doesn't make any sense because they wouldn't let me not be caught. Right after that cutscene, I was instantly caught. And I tried to hide from that guy, and he, he knew where I was before I even walked out the door. But whatever. <sighs> whatever. I'm gonna stop this here. And I think I'm gonna keep going because I need to get some of this done. A lot of this done, actually. Martin, finally... I receive your payment. The house will soon be restored to its former condition. I am pleased you are a man of your word. Martin Martinez, I think his name was. Dave. Michael, your weapons will be... Oh, shut up, Dave. Alright. Yeah, that's it for now. And then I'll do another one. Like, right now. You get what I'm saying? Alright, peace. <laughs>